Welcome, electronic video guests, to the outer limits of the trading card hobby TTM. Through the mail, we seek to have the famous and the infamous sign the trading cards and photographs we send to them through the mail. Today we have seven such specimens to examine. Seven trading card autograph request return specimens to examine. So if you like seeing envelopes being cut open, you've come to the right place. Sit back, relax, and get ready to enjoy the fun. Presented to you from the worldwide YouTube video air fill. Seven TTMs to look at on this Monday morning. Uh, before we get started, let me point this card out right here. Look at that beautiful Roosevelt Leaks autograph card. Sweet old Topps card. Check that out. That is a sweet 1977 Topps card. Roosevelt Leaks. I won that in a contest sponsored by Mr. J. Pylon. I'm going to give away on his channel. If you want to look at Jay's great stuff, get over to Jay Pylon. There's his YouTube info. Also got all his info, all his updates on Twitter. Check those out. I won a duck race over there on Jay Pylon's channel. It's probably one of the best races I ever ran, ever swam, I should say. Set me a new personal best just under. I cracked a one-minute barrier. And for my... <laughs> Reward, I got me that sweet Roosevelt Leaks autograph card. Thank you, Mr. Pylon. Once again, I highly recommend you checking out his channel. He's got TTMs, Gematria, all kinds of great stuff. Check him out on YouTube and Twitter. And then after we get done with our TTMs, we're going to give away, look at that beautiful card, this sweet 2022 Wander Franco Living Set Rookie Card. Wander's back. He's healthy this year. He's off to a great start. So is Tampa. I think they're like, what, 14 and 2. Wander's hitting beautifully so far this year. 100% again and showing that he is on his way to the Hall of Fame. Wander Franco will be giving away that rookie card. All right, so that's going to be a lot of fun stuff today. Unbelievable. Whoa, what a great time we're going to have. Let's get started with our TTMs. TTM number one, coming to us from Miami, Florida. What do we got coming to us from Miami, Florida? TTM number one, let's check it out. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. Mr. Joey Bosa. Look at that nice signature there. He put his name and number on there. Joey Bosa, 27 years old. Active, all-pro football player. Signing this sweet 2022 prestige card. Joey Bosa. All-American at the Ohio State. Number three overall draft pick in the 2016 draft by the Chargers. National Football League Defensive Rookie of the Year in 2016. Four-time Pro Bowler. He's already got 60 and a half career sacks. 14 forced fumbles. Of course, he did have that very dumb penalty in the wild card round playoff game against Jacksonville last year. He threw that temper tantrum and threw his helmet all over the field, got a 15-yard penalty. He and the rest of the Chargers had a meltdown, lost their composure, choked away that game after taking a 27-0 lead. But a great player, all pro. 16 and a half sacks already. Joey Bosa, active Pro Bowl player. Can you believe that? This is a great return. Thank you, Mr. Bosa, for signing that sweet, sweet prestige card. 
Joey Bosa, number 97. Check that out. It's great to get an active player and a pro bowler, too. Great way to start with a Joey Bosa DTM. Fantastic. We like that. All right. That is a great way to start. Let's go on to TTM number two. This one is coming to us from Columbus Ohoho. Columbus Ohoho. What do we got coming to us from Columbus Ohoho? Oh, we got our 1990 Tops card signed by Mr. Brad Kamensk. Look at that signature. That's kind of a that's kind of a odd <laughs> signature. Looks like he flatlined or something there. Brad Comments. I guess he signed his name on that. <laughs> Brad Comments. Thank you, sir. 61 years old. Look at this sweet 1990 Tops card. Of course, Brad was very, very heavily hyped in his amateur days and early days, a high school prospect. Number four overall draft pick by Atlanta. Back in 1979, Hank Aaron said he was a can't miss. Baseball America said he won the Triple Crown. Of course, he did miss. He didn't win a Triple Crown. In 2011, he was named one of the 50 most disappointing prospects of all time by Baseball Prospectus. Brad Comics played parts of eight seasons for six teams. <laughs> Finishing with a lifetime batting average of 218 with only 23 home runs. The much ballyhooed high school schoolboy baseball star Hank Aaron said he was a can't miss. He goes down as one of the biggest misses in baseball history. But we appreciate him signing this 1990 top Scardy. Drew a straight line with a couple of squiggles on it. Thank you, Mr. Brad Comics. That's a hard name to say. Comics. Thank you, sir, for signing that card. All right, what do we got next? TTM coming from somewhere in the universe. Dropped in our mailbox by the that. Behind all that. Let's see what we got from the that. Behind all that. Let's get our card out. Oh, we got another 1990 Tops card. This one signed a little bit better than Brad Comics did. Look at this. Clay Parker inscribed it and signed it with a name you can actually read. Beautiful. Oh, it's a 1991, not a 1990. Clay Parker with that 1991 Tops card. Look at that. Thank you, Mr. Parker, for taking your time and signing that so beautifully. I like those 91 Tops cards. Old Clay, 60 years old. Unlike Brad Comments, he was not a Ballyhooed schoolboy. 15th round draft pick by Seattle in 1985 out of LSU. Pitched parts of four years in the big leagues with the Mariners, Yankees, and Detroit Tigers. Finished his career with seven wins, ten losses, and a 4.42 ERA. Thank you, Clay Parker, for signing this card, taking your time, and doing it right. Really appreciate it. Clay Parker on the 1991 Tops card. That looks great. That really came out nice. Beautiful. Thank you, Mr. Parker. All right, we're going to keep rolling along with our TTMs. This next one is coming to us from the Steel City, Pittsburgh, PA. What do we got coming to us from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania? Let's see what we got. A 1991 Top Stadium Club hockey card. Signed by a Hall of Fame right winger, Mark Recchi. Outstanding. That is a beautiful signature on that stadium club card. Hall of Famer, 55 years old. Played 22 years in the National Hockey League. Three-time Stanley Cup champion. Oldest player ever to score a goal in a Stanley Cup final at 
age 43. Seven-time All-Star, MVP of the 1997 All-Star Game, still holds the Flyers' single-season scoring record with 123 points. He scored 577 career goals. Hall of Fame right winger Mark Recchi. Look at that beautiful 1991 Stadium Club card. Thank you, sir. I'll tell you, these, these hockey players are probably the best signers in TTM. Even the Hall of Famers, they just sign for free. They don't beg for money. These guys are great. Thank you, Mr. Recchi. Really appreciate that. Hall of Famer signing that stadium club card. Look at that as a beauty. Mark Recchi. Thank you, sir. You know, we've had some good returns today. Joey Bosa and Mark Recchi and the can't miss that did miss. Brad Kaminsk. Outstanding. All right, what's next? Denver, Colorado. Denver CO, Denver, Colorado. And that's where they got that weird airport out there in Denver, the uh, New World Order Airport. We got our looks like we got our note and our card. If we can pull that stuck in there, good. Let's pull all that out. Let's see who we got. We got another Stadium Club hockey. Oh, beautiful! Look at that one. Doug Smale, that is a beautiful signature on the 91 Stadium Club card. Look at that sweet old hockey card. Mr. Doug Smale, outstanding. 65 years old, played left wing 13 years in the National Hockey League, undrafted free agent, played college hockey at North Dakota, he played his first 11 seasons with Winnipeg. He holds the record for fastest goal ever scored. Five seconds into a game in December 1981. Five seconds after the faceoff. 210 career goals. Best season was 1984-85 with Winnipeg. Scored 31 goals. One-time All-Star, Doug Smale. Thank you, sir, for signing that 91 Top Stadium Club card. Beautiful. These hockey players are great about signing. Doug Smale, thank you, sir. Really appreciate that. Let's see if he answers any questions on the note. All right. These hockey players answered the questions, too. Let's see what Mr. Smale said. Doug Smale. Did you have any favorite teammates on those old Winnipeg Jets teams? All teammates are special. Any opposing players you really disliked? All of them. L-O-L. <laughs> All right. Really appreciate that. He says, best wishes, Jeff. And he signed his name down there, too. Mr. Doug Smale, thank, uh, <laughs> thank you, sir. Really appreciate you signing that and answering those questions. Look at that beautiful card. All right. We got, what, two to go? This one here is coming to us from Boston. M.A. Boston, Massachusetts. Ooh, let's see what we got from Boston. What do we got from Boston? Ah, we got another one of our 91 Stadium Club hockey cards. This one I sent out. I knew it was going to be tough to get a good signature. It's so dark, but you can kind of see there. Mr. Ken Hodge signed that. He got a little blue ink. You can see parts of that blue ink. And you can see a little bit better there with the glare. Ken Hodge, thank you, sir, for signing this almost all black 1991 top stadium club hockey card. Ken Hodge, of course, 57 years old, son of the Bruins legend Kenny Hodge. He didn't have near the success his dad did. He did have a great rookie season with the Bruins in 91. After bouncing around in the minors for several years, he scored 30 goals. But he'd only score eight more goals in parts of two more seasons. He ended up playing in the British Hockey League for a couple of years. If he even knew there was such a thing, he played for a team in Wales. <laughs> Ken Hodge, thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Son of uh, Bruin legend Kenny Hodge. 
And we got some nice stadium club hockey returns today. Ken Hodge, thank you, sir. All right, here's our last one. This is coming to us from Ohoho also. Cincinnati, Ohoho. What do we got coming to us from Cincinnati, Ohoho? Let us take a look and see. <clears throat> what do we got coming to us from Cincinnati? Oh, we got our, we got our Zach. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> this is Zach Taylor, 2007 Tops rookie guard. <laughs> of course, Zach Taylor is the head coach of the Cincinnati Bengals. Look at that autograph. If that's, I guess that's. Look at that one. Looks like he got a ballpoint pen out and <laughs> put his. That's one of the <laughs> worst autographs I've ever seen. But <laughs> he did try to sign it. Zach Taylor, thank you, sir, for getting that ballpoint pen out and uh, trying to sign your name on that. Zach Taylor, thank you, sir. Really appreciate that weak autograph on your Topps rookie card. 39 years old, head coach of the Cincinnati Bengals. He had two very rough seasons <clears throat> to begin his career there after he was the quarterback coach for Sean McVay in L.A. You know, but the Bengals stuck with this guy. They just didn't abandon ship. They waited till they got him some players. Of course, Joe Burrow. Then the Bengals have been one of the best teams in football last couple of years. Uh, he got to the Super Bowl in 2021. Very nearly got there again last year. He played quarterback in college. Bouncing around from Wake Forest to Butler Community College and then to Nebraska. Then he was an undrafted free agent, signing by Tampa in 2007. Released even before training camp started. Luckily, his father-in-law was the head coach at Texas A&M. So he was able to get started on a coaching career there mainly as a tight ends coach, and of course the rest, as you know, is history. He's done a great job with the Cincinnati Bengals. Much better job coaching than he did autographing, as you can see. Take a look at that signature, Zach Taylor. Thank you, sir, for signing that card. We know you're busy with the draft. You didn't have time to really uh, spend a lot of hours working on a nice uh, autograph. We appreciate you taking the trouble during this busy draft season to sign your 2007 Tops rookie card. Zach Taylor, thank you, sir. Really appreciate that. Zach Taylor, head coach of the Cincinnati Bengals. <laughs> Outstanding. Well, those are some great TTNs. We got a Zach Taylor, Joey Bosa, Mark Recchi, Hall of Famer, Brad Commons, the can't miss who missed. Beautiful. Well, we said we was going to give away this 2022 Tops Living Set Wander Franco Rookie Card. What do you have to do to win this beauty? He's off to a great start now that he's healthy again. All you got to do is get down there into the comments field by 10 a.m. April 21st, 2023, put in the comment field, hashtag WF. If only one person puts that in, we'll send you the card. If more than one, we'll do a random drawing. Again, get that hashtag WF in the field by 10 a.m. 21, April 2023. Sorry. U.S. mailing addresses only. I'm not a millionaire like a lot of you card guys are. I live on a tight budget. I can't afford to mail this Wander Franco card out to Ukraine. Our government maybe can send billions and billions of dollars in weapons and handouts to Zelensky, but I can't send a Wander Franco card to Ukraine. That's a lot of stamps. 
I'm just scraping to get by here. U.S. mailing addresses only, no foreign addresses for this 2022 Wander Franco Living Set Rookie Card. Somebody's going to win a sweet old Franco Rookie Card. Well, we're just about ready to hit the stop button and dump yet another TTM video into the worldwide YouTube video air fill. Before we go, remember two things. Number one, enjoy the rest of your life. Number two, get you over to Amazon.com. Type in this author's name. That's your narrator. Type in that book, con uh, book title into the comment field on Amazon. This book will pop right up. Do yourself a favor and buy this book. This is one of the hardest hitting books you will ever read. If you want to know what the day-to-day -day grind of human existence is all about, stuff that will grind you into dust and make you wonder why you ever got dropped into this mess in the first place, this is the book for you. But if you're easily offended and you like to just pretend things is going to get better, you don't want to get that book. You might cry or have some panic attack or something. Stay away. But if you're a big boy or a big girl or a big tranny and you can handle these type of things, get over to Amazon and buy you a copy of this book. All right, people. What an episode we had. Let's take a look one more time at an active NFL Pro Bowler signing a TTM. You don't see that every day. Joey Bosa, thank you, sir. Look at that. An active NFL Pro Bowler signing that 2022 prestige card. Joey Bosa, thank you, sir. Even though you're from the Ohio State and you played your college ball in Ohoho. Thank you, sir. Really appreciate that. We'll be back, God willing, soon with some more. Like I said, until then, remember, enjoy the rest of your life.